actually, 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 actually. <laughs> I knew a student a long time ago, and she began every sentence with actually. And she was a high level speaker too, I would say. What did you do last weekend? Actually, I went to see a movie. Huh? Mm, okay. okay. <laughs> Alright, let's talk about actually or in fact. I use in fact when I want to talk about something that is contrary to expectations. Like this. The weather report said that today it would be sunny, but in fact, it's raining. Just against our expectations, right? Or, uh, my sister wants to take a test, English test. I don't know why, but she's taking an English test. And I expect her to do really well. Mm -hmm. So after she takes the test, I ask her, uh, did the test go well? You know, did you do as well as you hoped? And she says, no, in fact, I failed. The result is in contrast to the expectation. That is in fact. English. Another use of in fact is to emphasize or to add some new information. My grandfather is very old. In fact, he's 95. This is not contrary to my expectations, it's adding new information. Korea this year is very cold. In fact, yesterday it was minus 21 degrees. I'm emphasizing something. That's when we use in fact. Actually, 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 actually. Actually, it's a very common expression that not only Koreans, but also like a lot of native speakers, they threw out so many times. And yes. I'm a little bit kind of confused because actually, 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 you know, like every single second. Yes. Tell me about the usage and the... Uh, uh, How does it sound? You know. If you habitually use actually, it's really annoying. Uh, it sounds unprofessional, frankly, if you like. Uh, I'm, I'm into sports. Actually, I watched football yesterday, and actually my favorite football player was playing, and actually they won, you know, like... <laughs> Who are you trying to convince? I mean, why, are you keep, why do you keep saying actually? It sounds, it sounds annoying, frankly. So I would encourage you to not use it for no reason, all right? Um, whenever it does have meaning, actually is, it can be used similarly to in fact. I didn't pass the test. Actually, I failed the test. That's a good usage of, of actually. That's not annoying. That's perfectly appropriate. Right? The forecast said it would be sunny today, but actually it's raining. That's also a perfectly okay usage of actually. Another good usage of actually is to correct somebody when they're wrong which is a little sensitive thing, all right? So let's say, for example, Luke says to me, hey, Joseph, and I go, uh, actually, it's Peter. Hmm? I'm correcting him, it's okay, it's really okay. Or if somebody says, um, Peter, you're from England, right? And I go, uh, actually, I'm from America. I'm correcting him, it's perfectly okay. That can piss some people off, though. Okay, my favorite band is BTS. And then my friend goes, actually, BTS sucks. If you do that, it kind of pisses people off. So you got to be careful with that kind of thing. Or even something like, the capital of North Korea is Pyongyang. Actually, it's pronounced Pyongyang. You know, that, that kind of attitude, that's, how, that's what it actually sounds like, so. You can use it, but I would advise you to be careful about it. In fact, and actually are very useful words when used correctly, but if you misuse them, or use them in a wrong way, you're liable to make some people angry or annoyed. So I would suggest, if you're a habitual speaker of actually, try to cut it out. English.